video sector, there are three main products. The first product, known as the Global IP Premium, so a 2 megabit connection, which was normally at 67,200, is now, the price has been reviewed to 28,350. On average, you will see, we'll take an example of three different connection speeds. We have an average of around 60% price decreasing that we are now seeing as of today. For those who need speed, that means they're happy with the price, but they need speed, the 2 megabit connection, with the price will be increased. For the same price, you will get a 10 megabit connection, and the rest you can see. Any customer, an ICT BPO customer using the global IP premium has a choice to make. And this is where we will assist our customers in terms of counseling and we will sit down with them to understand the business model is to see whether they would like to go for a decrease in price or they would like to go for an increase in speed or maybe a combination of both. The global NPLS, which is more of a specialized service for large BP. It's a point-to-point -point dedicated guaranteed bandwidth with redundancy. This is a straightforward price decrease of between 15 to 31%. It's the IPVPN Pro, which actually amounts to high-speed internet. In this segment, we have gone for a significant increase in speed for the same price. By doing so, what we want to do is encourage the ICT BPO businesses to bring more business to Mauritius. We want to be an enabler. Mauritius Telecom is an enabler. We're not competing with our, with our partners. We want to enable their business. One of the key aspects of this price reduction and these, these new offers is that we are setting up a specialized team to devise customized offers according to your needs as, uh, as you may require, as per your business model. We are reviewing our team and the time to installation will be shortened from eight weeks to one week as from now, assuming clearances from local authorities, of course, are taken. So as from probably the 1st of October, you will have access to a very fast service. So within the next three months, granting, of course, that the building owners give us the permission, we shall be putting fiber in all the buildings in the service city, which affects nine, more than 90% of the ICT BPO customers. As from the 1st of October, BPOs will benefit from a same-day repair service. Our business hours are normally from 9 to 4. As from the 1st of October again, we are extending our service to a 24-7 around-the-clock service for all ICT BPO companies. Today, we can either stand still and see the industry becoming more and more uncompetitive on the world market, or we decide a change in strategy here, so with the new tariffs, we'll be mostly amongst the top three or four countries in the world with the new tariffs. And this was important for us because together with the industry, we want to attract new investors, we want to attract new améliorer un petit peu les services financières parce que par exemple s'il y avait une panne pendant qu'on rendait haut avec les techniciens ça prend deux ou trois jours est-ce que vous avez l'intention de changer un petit peu sur cette procédure sur cette lenteur dans le système c'est une question très intéressante parce qu'en fait il y, a, il, y a, il y a plusieurs aspects là où les clients ont des, ont des problèmes il y a une grosse partie des problèmes qu'on a découvert c'est parce que quand vous installez par exemple un modem chez le client c'est nouveau pour lui parce qu'il y a plusieurs devices alors pour, pour, pour connecter le, le printer pour connecter le laptop etc il y a ces types de problèmes ça c'est une éducation du, du, du client qu'il faut faire et qu'on va, qu va faire. Euh, et puis deuxième, il y a les problèmes qui sont liés à l'infrastructure. Par exemple, si un câble euh, a un problème qui est, qui est en dessous de la terre, un problème, ça prend deux ou trois jours. Mais si ce n'est pas ces problèmes-là et c'est une intervention qu'il faut faire spontanément, ça aussi, comme je l'avais annoncé quelques mois de là, on est en train de restructurer l'équipe technique complètement pour revoir comment on peut accélérer ce processus et travailler vers, encore une fois, un service qui soit euh, within 24 hours.